Greetings fellow LEGO chefs and brick enthusiasts, Aris here and today we're cooking up a storm at the LEGO House Mini Chef Experience. We will also be sharing with you some top tips for this experience as well as the LEGO shop, so keep on watching! There are a number of places just right outside the Lego house where you can eat. But inside, there are two main places, which is the Bricacino, which is a coffee shop, and the Mini Chef Experience, which is a restaurant. We're at Mini Chef. It's a very popular restaurant here because there are Lego robots that serve, uh, that have you your, your food. And, yeah, and you're going to need Lego. to. You're going to need to you're build gonna need your to food. Build your, your food, put it in some sort of machine, and it comes out with your food. That's, That's very food. nice. It's not just a meal, it's a culinary journey. Don't forget, folks, to book your spot for this Lego themed lunch because you will need a separate reservation to dine in the Mini Chef experience. I also did want to have a special mention to the staff here, particularly Luis who has wonderfully taught us how everything works. So in the kitchen, there is no robot, and I can tell you there's no humans either. Oh, uh -huh. really? So can anyone guess who or what you think is making the food if it's not human? Who is it? And the adults! The adults? <laughs> adults are humans too. <laughs> The reason Mini Chef is considered an experience is because the restaurant does not have the typical menu. Each family member gets a set of Lego bricks and each brick represents a different dish. So you'll have to build your own menu and send it over to be prepared. Three. Renzo's ready. Are you ready? Yes, we're ready. Okay, put it I in. Thank you. Thank you. Okay, let's check what did he get it right? Did he get it right? Is that your order? You have a special gift, fish, fruits, and noodles. Correct. Look at, the, look at this one. It's so cool. I'll put this in. And then. Is that correct? That's correct. Press check. Check me. Okay, I think our order's finished. Why don't you check the basket? Yes. Is that what you order? Yes. Check? Yes. Okay, it's been sent to the kitchen. Okay, let's watch the video. Oh, Renzo, look, they're starting to cook. Oh, they're cooking it oh, It's amazing. Oh, his head is fire. I think it's ready. it's ready. Come on, let's go, let's go quick really does not end there. Once your food is ready, you can come over to Robert and Roberta to get your meals in the form of a giant Lego block. Renzo, look! Whoa! Hi, that's your one! That's our one! Move it to the side. Yeah, move, move it to the side. Here? The next one. Oh, go get the next one, Ayla. I'm going to help. I'm going to get the one here. Come on. Get your one. Okay, go. Cool. Ready? Open. Wow. Wow. Who is this? Go, go, go. Wow. wow. That's the chicken. Surprise. My one is... Look, I won't have a surprise. Only kids get the surprise. Because mommy likes food. And I must say, the food was really fantastic. I did not initially expect much coming from a Lego lunchbox, but 
it was really a treat and it exceeded our expectations. Definitely, if you are visiting the Lego house for the first time, this is a place you would want to visit. Now we're heading into the Lego shop and trust me, it's not your average Lego store. There is an entire wall in the Lego house where you can buy exclusive sets that you can only get from the Lego house. And what's really nice about this is the store is outside the experience zone. So you won't need a ticket to buy from the store. Oh, Leicester Square and Amsterdam. Then I'll give you Lego House. Denmark. Mm -hmm. Apart from that, don't forget to get your Lego passport stamped before you head out the Lego shop. And for those of you who don't know, you can get a Lego passport for free in most official Lego stores. And if you bring it to pretty much your Lego journeys, you can get a stamp from the different Lego stores around the world. If you are interested in learning about our Lego house experience, I'll leave a link in the description below and in the top right hand corner. If you've enjoyed our Lego themed lunch journey, give us a thumbs up, comment down below with your favorite Lego memories, and as always, hit that subscribe button. And we'll see you in our next Lego themed location.